Hi everybody! In this video we will be talking about if Rogaine or Minoxidil really works, what's even better and why I stopped using Rogaine or Minoxidil. So just to give you a short overview, I'm fighting hair loss for 10 years now. Let me give you a short look on my hair. It's really good now. It's really good now. Also have a look at my other video I released today. It's about how to apply minoxidil or Rogaine or topical solutions. Um, I used Rogaine for about five years and it was very, very successful. Um, although I used the combination of Rogaine and Finasteride or Propecia. And Rogaine is primarily for regrowing your hair, whereas uh, Finasteride is there to keep your hair or to strengthen your hair from the scalp. So if you're just using Rogaine on its own, um, you will get a good boost at the beginning. Some people experience some shedding, but in my opinion, that's just creating panic. Uh, when you have a look at some discussion boards, uh, shedding, shedding is just, in my, in my opinion, it's just uh, panic creation. Um, I know lots of people who were using Rogaine or Minoxidil and they had no shed at all, me included. Um, at the beginning there was no effect at all, um, no negative effect at all, to be honest. Um, after two or three months, I did not even got a lot of regrow, but after three, two or three or four months, I can't say it really uh, that clear anymore, but I realized that my hair was getting thicker. I did not have a lot of regrow, which means I did not have a lot of new hair growing. Although I must admit, I had lots of new hair growing after I added Finasteride. But just using Minoxidil or Rogaine, I did not have that much regrow, but my hair looked healthier. It was thicker and the overall look improved dramatically which was all the good. Uh, and since everybody said, if you're just using Minoxidil, you will get a boost and then your hair will start to fall out again because Minoxidil does not improve the, 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 the main cause of hair loss itself. So that's why I added Finasteride. I added some, some uh, small amount directly into the topical Rogaine and also I took it oral. But those two in combination gave me a really good boost, boost and five years I could hold a status and also improve it a little bit. Um, to be honest, I did not really have much side effects, but somehow um, I mean, I had some side effects, but somehow it was just, um, I always had a bad feeling. Not really about Minoxidil, but I knew that Minoxidil alone won't do magic, maybe just for a small period of time, but it won't do magic over a long period of time without a combination of Minoxidil or something else that really helps to uh, lower your DHT level. So I knew I was a little bit worried about Finasteride. I also had some side effects, which I was sure that they came from Finasteride. Um, so I decided one day to stop medical treatments. Although once again, Minoxidil and Finasteride, especially in combination, were very successful. 
just a short summary. I did not get a lot of regrow, but let me tell you one thing. I know lots of people who are suffering hair loss and trying to, to fight it with minoxidil and finasteride. And regrow, having a good regrow is really something special. If you have a lot of regrow, you're one of a hundred maybe. So my advice for everybody who is experiencing thinning hair or beginning of balding hair, start fighting your hair loss as soon as possible because hair that is gone is gone. In fact, um, if you really have a good regrow, you, you can be very, very lucky. But I would not expect to have regrow. If you can hold the situation or your hair status, you already have very, very good success. So I stopped minoxidil and finasteride and I, after four months, I realized that my hair was getting worse. Um, it did not look as healthy as with the medical treatment. Um, I did not lose a lot of hair, but it was just maybe I would have it. I would have lost hair, but uh, not after four months. But I already realized that it is getting weaker. So maybe the next point would have been that I would have lost hair. But again. Back when I was on medical treatments, I already made uh, some thoughts what could be after medical treatments. So I did not stop from zero. I already had a plan to fight my hair loss with natural treatments. So there are a few points. It was living healthier. Uh, I was creating my own topical solution, which is very uh, applying it almost the same like minoxidil, but just with natural ingredients. I was doing a style change because when you're fighting hair loss, your haircut, for example, is very important. So if I can show it to you, I keep my sides short and on top a little bit more. And that's also the status that I had when I was using minoxidil. So overall I am on medical I was on medical treatments for five years, primarily minoxidil finasteride, and I'm fighting my hair loss with natural treatments for almost four or five years now. Both methods were as were very successful equal successful to be honest uh, I could if someone would ask me to start with minoxidil I would always say go for it there's nothing to lose maybe just make sure if you want to use the foam or the liquid minoxidil you can it's in my opinion it's it's both more or less the same I I I tried both, none of them is better or worse. Um, just make sure where to buy it. There, are, there is a, a, a huge price range when buying minoxidil. In my opinion, um, there is no need to buy the, the brand product. It's just, there are just some ingredients in minoxidil and you can also go for, for anyone else or you can also go to a pharmacy and get your own minoxidil mixed, which is also a very good way. So I hope I could tell you something if minoxidil worked. For me, it worked perfectly. Um, I could really improve my hair situation. It looked healthier. It looked thicker. It looked like there was more hair, although there was not even more hair, but it was Overall, I was very happy that I tried minoxidil and that I used minoxidil for five years. So please subscribe to my channel if you are suffering hair loss because here we will share so much ideas on experience and knowledge 
which will be very helpful for you to fight hair loss. No matter if you're a boy, no matter if you're a girl, give me a thumb up, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Um, and see you soon. Have a nice day. Bye.